you disappeared. Yeah. <laughs> he's not even gonna fight he's, 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 he's gonna agree with you. He's like, alright, man, you're right. <laughs> Absolutely correct. <laughs> well, Larry Lowe bringing out the Shulk. Oh, yeah, he just said he was trying to work on the Shulk, too. Yeah. He definitely put Shulk to good work. I over at Fire and Dice last week. Yeah, didn't he say Shulk was the. He thought Shulk was the best? I, I think, in my honest opinion, and even Razo agrees with me and a couple other players, I think. Shulk, Peach, and Link are the three best characters in the game. Link has a little bit more of a hard time uh, between the three. That's why I put him at the third. But, like, they're such great characters that not anybody can just pick them up. Like, in my opinion. Like, you can't just pick up Shulk and start winning. Like, True. it takes time. And, of course, Larry has so much time being a great player and, and super technical that he knows how to play this character off the bat. Probably and, obviously, him and Nico are part of the same crew, so they can always exchange notes. Hmm. Peach, on the other hand, like, it falls into Razo's hands because Razo's already been a great Peach. For such a long time. His hand, so, he's yeah. already got that muscle memory in exactly. with Peach. Peach is just so scary. And she has so many good tools that you can use. And, and same thing for Link, right? Like, he has all these tools. And he requires a lot of technical knowledge. A lot of scenarios. We saw him. We've been seeing Link also in great places with Salem. Uh, with Salem. Oh, yeah. Salem playing Link. He's all over there in Europe. He got ninth. Even Rex down in uh, SD. He's yeah. been tearing up the SD scene. Exactly. So, we've been seeing these three characters, in my opinion, they're going to be... On, I think they're the top tier characters for sure. Interesting. They're, they're, in my opinion, you know, top top tier for sure. I can't stand. Oh, it's just barely gonna live that up, B. So Larry kind of playing it safe. I like the empty hop gets the grab, goes for the fourth throw, won't take the still, gets more stage control, keeps the edge guard phase going. But smash yep. R and that'll do it. Yeah. Larry taking a bit of notes from uh, Nico right there. Nico really good at once he gets you on the ledge at the percent and he gets the smash art up. It's just. You're so scared you don't know what to do, and sometimes you'll just neutral get up out of fear and just, you know, immediately get down throw or a four throw. Yeah. Down there, no. Not gonna kill this yet. Right now, Master does not care about the shoal. <laughs> I, I was terrified <laughs> I, too, bro. I, I, yeah, I was gonna say, man, that's a tech chase because bro, he, 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 he just on. stood there menacingly. Yeah, like, he, oh. he's like, what are you gonna do, man? What I don't, are you gonna do? I don't blame you. I was terrified too. I didn't know what was gonna happen there. But luckily, gonna get out of there. Okay. Grab fourth throw. Master Mario finally puts an edge guard phase of his own here. And Larry opts to jump high, narrowly getting clipped there by the down air. Oh, but now you're in the shield. I like it. Master Mario continues this combo even when shields are activated. That's so. That's such a good thing you need to do against Shulk once you're in shield. Because if you have combos that usually work at the mid percent, and then you had high and he goes into shield, you might as well just go back to that combo. Because once it's out, you're just at such a higher percent that more of your things are going to start killing. Yeah. Spot dodge again. Immediately going into shield. Okay, there's the parry. They're going for a fair. Interesting, uh... You were talking about earlier how Master Mario, he's been practicing on his parries, right? And that frame advantage you get when you get the parry, pretty beneficial. We're not going to get hit by that up B. Oh, oh. We're trying to read the roll. And I like it too because in that situation, the way that Larry has been edge guarding Master Mario, he kind of expected him to just go for oh, a roll. So many up airs. That throw that won't take it, but Master Mario with edge guard phase and Larry able to land with side B. Oh, he's in the grab. Nah, he's. I was gonna say he's good. Yeah, he's got jump art. Yeah. And it, it always seems like oh he's gonna SD right there, but you know, it doesn't happen. Back it up down smash though, gonna kill. And really, just this game against this uh, this Shulk, it shows a lot about Master Mario. Last week, he played against Nico a bunch of times. And whenever Nico went into the shield art, you saw Master would kind of keep going for the same combos that he would go for, and it wouldn't work. But now you see him, he's like, oh, okay, he's in shield, more combo time. And he's just doing a lot of up airs. He's racking up so much percent when he goes into it, which is what you got to do in shield. You just got to keep juggling them, especially when they're in that high percent. Yeah. Alright, well, game two. Nico gonna change the shulk, put it into Wolf. Put it into the doggo. That's a wolf, man. That's not a dog. You right. I'm sorry, I didn't. No disrespect to the wolf mains out there. Oh, same family, though. I mean, yeah. the dog did come from the wolf originally, so. Kind of close, but anyway, let's get back into it. Larry doing a pretty solid job spacing in the neutral game. Yeah. Alright, nice. Using him, able to use the dash tent to lure Master Mario in. Larry gets a down throw. Kind of putting himself at the ledge. Up throw yet again into up the back, back air. air. That's okay. new. All right. I'm going to add that to the repertoire. I didn't know. 
you know, Larry uh, thinking that Wolf is the best out of the three species just because of the kill power and the uh, Wolf is really good in neutral. He oh. has all these. Bet I'm sorry, between between Fox and Falco. Uh, sorry, between between uh, Falco and Wolf, he thinks Wolf is the best one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just the the neutral option that Wolf has to put in there with that back air with the uh, oh, oh what a dunk. Yeah, with the back air with the the nair, all these options that you could just poke people out with. And like in Japan, you see Zachary doing such good things with Wolf. Yeah, people, people are calling him the MKLA of Japan. That blaster able to stun Master Mario. Just a little bit. Misses the grab of that forward smash from across the stage. Will take it. Master Mario gets a bit of a breather there, but that won't be too much breathing because he is down in terms of percent. Back throw. No, goes Ooh, for down, down throw. throw. I like how he's saving it too because back throw actually kills for Wolf. Yeah, it'll probably throw. start killing around the one. Yeah, about right now if he gets one towards the edge. But back oh. air, yeah, such a. Sent him a roll option such a good option because it takes a bit to start up so you're like I can challenge it and then when it comes out it hits so hard yeah then once you space around you can't really punish it the master trying to go on the offensive there not gonna get anything but oh, really good cross up he he read where Larry was gonna go but I don't think he realized that he'd crossed up up throw nice missing that forward there Throw it again into forward air. Okay, Larry's uh, Larry's kind of running away with this. He's doing really well, just spacing these options right where Master usually would want to do a grab, a down tilt, or uh, an up air out of shield. And he spaced it so he'll do that and then just get the whiff punish lag. All right, far throw. Like he just gets more stage control yet again. Down Ooh, smash. The, that down smash so strong, especially you get the tipper kill so early. Yeah. And you can't really punish it either. That's that's a really good thing about Wolf's smash attacks is that they're safe on shield, so you can press it. You can hit him with a smash attack, and then just go back to the neutral because it's still either even or your turn, or it's back to neutral. So, all right. Well, game three coming out from Master Mario. This is winner semi. This is best of five. So Master Mario has two chances here to see how things will go down between him and Larry. And honestly, game three pretty crucial. It does send the player. In terms of into set point, but only that counter um, counterpick stages and stages of choices is also important. Wow, reading the air dodge. No, he just stood there. That what a top player, man. He just stood there. Already knew like you're gonna you're gonna want to leave. I believe that was a falling fair too, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, he could have he could have gotten a bit more percent, but he just decided to return back to neutral just for the uh, the opportunity to get a better startup. Oh, and there's that forward air. He gets the landing here, and Master Mario trying to extend that combo. Larry getting the better of being on the stage. That, ooh, oh, that kills, bro. Swipe and left. That sucks. That sucks. You're not able to come back. That's going to send you off. Swipe left. Get him out of there. That F-tilt really good at a two-framing. His F-tilt and his down-tilt. Yeah. A two-frame pretty consistently. And that... uh. Four tilt being two hits. I'm so sorry. Yeah, but four tilt is two hits pretty fast, and they actually come out within rapid succession of each other. So there's not like about a one-frame delay between the two hits. Yeah, it was another It was another thing that uh, when playing against Wolf, you had to deal with in Brawl, too. Especially with all the freeze frames that happened with it. Yeah. Oh, we're almost jumping into that. That's the one. That's the two things that were changed from Wolf and Brawl, but he's still like potent still. Is the, the recovery and forward smash? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, a lot of people complain about the forward smash. Like he doesn't like slide a little bit forward anymore. He just kind of stays in place more of a punt. Mm -hmm. And then of course his recovery is a little bit like it's a little shorter, but of course still got some great things going on. And that's what the trade off is. I mean, Wolf yeah, now. no one's complaining about the nair change. Yeah, <laughs> that's yeah. for sure. What was his old nair? It was like you just kind of spin he's, around. He's spin. It, it was Meta Knight Nair. It, it looked. It, it did was, not look pretty. Yeah, it did not. It was Meta Knight Nair. That's what it was. Mm. Ooh, catching the air dodge down. Oh, there. and he sensed the jump option from Master. I feel like what, one thing he's doing about around Master is he's kind of forcing the options. Like, like We saw him trying to read his rolls. We saw him trying to read his, his get up options. Larry's kind of understanding, like, hey, I'm going to read what you're going to do after shield, not while you're in shield. Ooh, catching him fall, trying to fall down with the back air. Yeah, now Master's getting these little hits in, but he's not getting these big conversions. He's just he's guessing what Larry's gonna do, and then the chances he hits him, he's not really thinking that it's gonna hit. So he's not able to truly go into the advantage state. Yeah. Alright, back, back throw, that may do it. Kill. No, Ooh, not yet. Barely living. 
I like it. Larry uses the up air to actually move oh, his box from the blast zone, but then up smash won't change much after, after all. Larry was definitely trying to be cheeky right there. He wanted to just land on him. Hoped that Master wasn't going to do anything, but yeah, no, he scouted that out. Down oh, smash. Was, oh, so I don't know how that didn't hit. Up throw. Trying to go for the back air there again. Oh, missing that forward smash. Oh. I like it from Larry, like I said, he's kind of been reading Master Mario's defensive options so that he's there to find the punch afterwards. Like, see, he went for the forward because he knows he might have been trying to slot the ledge. Also, Larry was looking for a two frame. Forward throw as well. Missing that one. That's going to be a forward throw. So quick. Forcing out the edge phase. Nice rainbow roll there. He's just looking so consistent with these, uh, yeah, this ledge trapping. I like it. Wait, he's waiting for Master tomorrow. That's the scenario, right? Because he knows if I come back too quick, he's going to go for a 40. He's going to go for a read. Great cross up there. Back throw. Not going to kill him from center stage. Master Mario at 173. If he can clutch out of just a couple situations here. Nair? Unfortunately, that Nair back on the stage will do it. Oh, I forgot that was a kill option. Yeah. One thing I do like about Wolf, honestly, is his victory animations and things he says. Pretty cool. The only thing I don't like about Wolf right now is his uh, down taunt. Oh, it's get really bad. <laughs> yeah, it, it's like the, the... He has a... He only has one good taunt. The how? The how. The how. Yeah, that's the only... Fantastic own, taunt. Yeah, that's the best taunt. And I don't know what they did to it because compared to, compared to Brawl... Oh, man, was, that was scary. Yeah, both taunts were really great. The, the other one where he like puts his fist on the ground and like roars, that yeah, one were both good. The what's the matter scared? And then this one he and then this one is like a different. I don't, I don't know. He, he like had some great brawl taunts. Yeah, this one he has terrible. Only one good taunt, but it's okay, man. I'll take the trade off. Wolf is actually pretty decent. Yeah, they they nerfed the taunts, but they buffed the character. Mm -hmm. And you know, buffed enough, get him uh get him this game two or game three victory, going up two one in the set. Solid combo coming up from Master Mario and Larry landing in with neutral and coming out hot. With dash attack four to Larry moving on to edge face with that victory in hand. Two down smashes won't take it. Master Mario gets the back throw, stage control into his hands, charges the flood here. I like how he kind of spaced himself there, but he nearly tried to read the jump get up option for Larry, and Larry is up to get normal. You know, one of the things you really need to do against Wolf, you gotta you have to make sure to pressure him and make it seem like he you're always scared to be off stage as Wolf. So, you know, if you're not diligent enough, you're not doing everything smartly, you might die. But Master isn't really. Putting that pressure onto Larry, oh. great up smash. But Larry's also, to his uh, to his compliment, just doing really well, mixing up what he wants to do. I like to see Master go off stage a little more because he hasn't tried once to recover with the side B. Master Mario gets these solid up tilts into a great combo, starting off with a great lead. Can he carry Larry to the side? No, Larry pulling great DI, moving towards center stage. Master Mario just gets up B out of it. Oh, that was, Larry. A, that was a pretty cute combo, oh. but so is that. A Nair F smash, that was so fast, you didn't even think that should have connected. Yeah, master, master up now, another stock. <laughs> Alright, gets neutral air, Larry tosses in the blaster, hits Master Mario, still able to recover, I like how he's moving it for 4 throw, four gets throw. the grab, 4 throw. Larry just trying to get this, this stock out as safely as possible, down throw into up air. Not quite the percent yet where you need to go for down throw, but was that back air? Actually can't tell. Up throw forward air. Larry gets some solid percent. He's definitely working on this next dock. I mean, he's pretty much at set point. All right, kind of empty hopping. I like it. Larry just moving around Master Mario. He's moving away from the fireballs. And look at that because we know Master Mario coming up from last week, last night's MSM. He goes for a fireball and then he goes for a follow. And if Larry is able to move around that, he's able to come in and just go for a different option and just stop Master Mario from his game plan. So close. Almost gonna I definitely battle. thought he was just going to go for an up throw fair to try to cheese it out. But that was the percent over the uh, the potential. Back air, right? Tries to, d tries to two frame with the uh, down tilt. Catching the roll, scouting that out. Throw yet again. Larry's so good at reading him at the ledge. It's pretty demoralizing too, especially when your opponent can effectively read you in that back, back air. Just that will take it. Kill. Yeah, Larry gonna take that 3-1. Yeah. Your great stuff from Larry. Pretty great wolf showcase. Like he mentioned to us earlier, he's been working on these three characters. Wolf